What is the crack, lads? We are back with episode six of our Pez 2013 Master League. So let me know what you guys thought of episode five because it was like a highlights package with a lot of different stuff going on and a lot of just like little highlights and kind of like an overview of like five, six plus games. So I think I'm going to try and mix up the format a little bit because we are, if we get to the Champions League final or if we get to the cup finals. Yeah, so for this, lads, I am going to actually sim this um, because as I said, we are, you know, we are pretty in a, in a really good position. Hopefully we can pick up all three points. We do pick up all three points in that and Benfica keep keep tabs on that. But we are going to play this match against Sunderland. I will see you guys at kickoff. We'll go over the squad. We're going to have a chat about transfers and uh, kind of tired today. But uh, yeah, we will see what happens. Let's see you kickoff, lads. Ronaldinho's injured, lads. That is not good. That is not good. Out for a week. He wants to speak to me. Bubba. What do you expect if you keep playing me until I run to a standstill in every game? Okay, Ronaldinho, I don't like that lip now. I don't like that attitude, okay? You haven't been playing every single game. I've been resting you. So don't give me that type of shite. All right, let's, we're back at Old Trafford playing against Sunderland. Sunderland have, have a tasty little team. They've got John O'Shea, they've got Wes Brown, they've got Campbell up front. They've got a nice little squad, but we've got a couple of injuries. We saw Ronaldinho go down. Rooney has to score one of them. There we go. Giggs playing in that attacking midfielder role, using all his experience. And Rooney, lads, is keeping me in this Premier League. What an absolute beast. It's been coming, though. Rooney, chasing, chasing. Come on, boys. But yeah, I definitely think we need a bit of fresh blood. I think we need a bit of fresh blood up front and have Rooney up front with somebody. And I also think that we need, in my opinion, like, I know Harty is, like, an absolute beast and he plays above his stats. But we probably need another centre back and we probably need a midfielder as well. Carrick is grand, but he offers nothing going forward, like at all. I probably need somebody like Vidal. I know we could have got Vidal, but I wanted to wait and see what you guys wanted to do. Oh, Ashley Young. Oh, nearly burst past O'Shea, but he's seen it all in the training pitch before. And Raphael Harty, his replacement. Another Irish beast. Oh, Harty. Relax, Harty. They're getting the women in the crowd a bit excited with those moves. Kagawa. Oh, to Giggs. Oh, that would have been the goal of the season so far. What a little treaded true pass. <whistles> through the eye of a needle. Kagawa. Left foot. Beautiful pass to Giggs. Should have shot it first time. It's a fantastic save, really. Yes. We'll take it, lads. We'll take it. I think we need to get up, lads. If we get up a couple of games, I'm not... I'm not saying it's impossible yet. Tottenham have 10 wins and one loss, right? But we can actually get up into that. I think we just need to score more goals. Like, we've, we've scored 13 goals, right? Which is one of the worst, obviously, in the top 10 teams. Um, Liverpool have only scored eight. But, like, City have scored 25. Like, they've nearly doubled what we're scoring. So, it's kind of similar to real life at the moment. The Fergie era is becoming the body era now at this stage. But I do think we need to put put a couple of uh, results together and just start dominating. So lads, I forgot as well. Well, this was a huge polarizing thing back. I remember in the community back in Pez 2013 that you could actually buy boosts and, you know, you had the boots and you had the boosts for the players. So for example, for here, you could earn GP by playing matches and by winning stuff and you'd have it up in the top right-hand corner. So this was kind of the initial inception of MLO and what would eventually become my club. But you could actually buy, like, say, top five uh, or five plus experience points for top speed. So when I buy this, right, and I go back out and I go to equipment, I could literally go to, let's just say I wanted to go to Harty, right? And I could go to equipment items and then I could put his speed up by five. So what a lot of people were doing was with the right boots, so for this, right, Harty is getting a boost to his, um, I can give Harty a pair of boots here, right, so he's wearing at the moment, he's wearing these boots, which are giving him this, uh, these stats, right, which is basically like different every time you get a pair of boots, right, but if I was to give him these ones and boost up his pace a little bit, um, which I could go with, like, say, let me see, he's at 76. I could go to 77, maybe, where his shot accuracy goes down, but everything else goes up. Um, 
So if I give him these boots, right, where he goes up one, I could give him these boots. Well, Ronaldinho has them boots, but you know what I'm saying, right? I can give him a pair of boots that, say, somebody has, like, say, here, one of my goalkeepers. So I can give Harty these boots, which boosts up his, his pace. And I can also give him this top speed, which upgrades his top speed to an 82 overall. Now, that was fine with players like that. But, like, say, for example, that I was to give somebody like, let's say, Nanny, right? I could give Nanny, who's got 94 explosive power and 87 top speed, I could give Nanny these boots here to bring him up to a 96 and a 90 for the pace, or I could give him these ones, which, I, which no player has at the moment. All right, lads, we are at the Liberty Stadium against Swansea. This could be a cracker of a game, but I think I've... I'm playing a formation today, right? I'm playing three at the back. I'm playing a 3-4-3. So Nani and Giggs are shoved up. Kagawa is on with Ronaldinho. Johnny Evans' last line of defence. Oh. Oh. It's a pen up. Ah, oh, Vidic, I went in. I was holding X. This is a disaster, lads. Ah. Oh. He's injured as well, is he? Okay, so he's not taking the, the gear. Ah, it's a great finish from Ashley Williams. I just chose the wrong way. Get up. Come on, Kagawa. Oh, Rooney's through the middle. What a ball to Rooney. Serious gap. Rooney! There's the equaliser. What a gap in the middle. Ashley Williams still celebrating his goal. Rooney doesn't miss those lads. Burst of pace. What a pass from Ronaldinho. Rooney. Rooney! Boom! He's done it again, lads. It's just shoot on sight from Wayne Rooney. He's unreal. What an unbelievable goal from Rooney. Come on, Rooney. We're up for this one, lads. We're up for it. What a squad. What a team. And this 3-5-2 or 3-4-3 formation now is something to think about as well. Oh, Nanny. He still has it. Nanny. Kagawa. Rooney for the hat-trick. Rooney! It's too easy, lads. It's too easy. Hold on, Ferdy. We've got space, lads. We've got space. We've got acres of space. Rooney's gone. He's gone. Rooney. Rooney. Why are you slowing down, Rooney? Rooney. Oh. Rooney. Rooney! Oh. Valencia, Berbatov. Oh, it's a shocking, shocking effort from Berbatov. Yeah, but he's disgusted with that one. Berba, just hold it up for Rooney so he can get a shot. It's all we want. Nani, nah, that's it, lads. It's a bad, bad draw for us. That's a shocking draw for us, lads. Nothing went our way. I just, without Rooney shooting on all cylinders, lads, I'm completely lost up front with Berbatov and whoever else I have on. And that's my problem the whole time. That's been my problem the whole time. City win, Arsenal win, Tottenham, they beat Tottenham. That's a huge result for Arsenal. Yeah, man, I'm 12 points behind Arsenal. Even if I beat them, I'm going to be nine points behind them. We're not scoring enough goals. Like, I'm going to have to have a look at the team. I don't know. I don't know, lads. I genuinely don't know. Burbitt have let me down big time in that episode, but yeah, that is it for me, lads. I will end it there, and I uh, hope you jo enjoyed that one. We do get a bit of money in. Um, we're going on to the to the to the Arsenal match. That's one that we pencil in at the start of the season. Now we know that Arsenal are the team to beat. We need all three points against Arsenal. We need to beat them. It's going to be a ten minute match. It's going to be very tense. We need the formation right. But yeah, that is it for me. I will talk to you later. Let's hope you're enjoying the series. Let me know any feedback. We will talk to you later. Peace.